Hey friends, in this video we're going to take a look at how you can get Markdown support into Anki. If you are not familiar with Markdown, it's a very popular um, writing uh, syntax where you can get rich formatting uh, from plain text. It's uh, very powerful. And uh, here is an example. If we open that image, you can see you have this syntax, right? This text produces the output on the right. Very cool. So. What we're going to do is um, I already have it pasted here, um, the link to this add-on. Uh, there will be a link in the description. Just click it and then you're going to get to this page uh, for the add-on Markdown and Kotex support. Just head on over to the bottom and copy this uh, ID here. And on Mac, it's Shift Command A to get this dialog. But if uh, you're on another platform, just um, try Control A or find some settings thing here look for add-ons like that bam you'll get the same menu and then click get add-ons and paste in the id here and click ok and you're going to get this uh, alert like that and then restart anki and uh, open up anki again bam and now when you uh, look at your um, add uh, card you, you can see there are some new types. In this case, it added the Cotex and Markdown basic and close. So those two are new. So let's just pick the basic one for now and write what is the capital of um, Albania. And you can see here it added a preview. Uh, so you can see how the Markdown is going to look. And this is just the field front and the second back, right? So if we add a hashtag here as for title, Bam, you're going to see it uh, made the text bigger. So let's write here the capital is uh, Tirana. And let's add uh, some underline here. Or actually, let's make it bold. Bam, you can see it was bold. And let's uh, just to try it out, add strike through. See if that works. And that also works. Nice. So that's how you add it. And uh, just to show you how it looks like on the phone, um, this is how it looks like on the phone. Thank you for watching and please do hit the like and subscribe.